everyone assalamu alaikum ramadan barak welcome back to another video so today i am going to be decorating my house for ramadan it is day four of ramadan and i'm and i know i'm quite late but i got sick in the initial days of ramadan so i wasn't able to do anything and so i thought of decorating the house i ordered these items before ramadan but they took a long while to come and i did not have any energy to decorate them during ramadan because i was sick but now alhamdulillah that i have recovered and i'm so excited to be decorating with you guys i'm not going to be decorating the entire house i'm just going to be adding some pieces in each of our rooms and kind of getting into the ramadan spirit so we are going to decorate it together inshallah if you enjoy this video do give this video a thumbs up share with your friends and family and also comment what type of content you want to see from me and i will add that to my content list inshallah and also do not forget to subscribe to my channel it would mean a lot for me and now let's get started so this is what i got from amazon and i know my voice might be a little bit crooked because i don't have the mic attached because i needed to cover this and my bluetooth mic is out of battery so bear with me <clears throat> so these are the items that i got from amazon and we're going to go through them one by one so let's go through these items one by one first i got these two uh, lanterns So this is what they look like. They are super cute and I love them. And I bought all of these items in gold because I feel gold is something that goes with every decor. And they also have a, it's kind of inside. So gave, oh, they also give me free tea lights, which is amazing. So you light these and then you put them back and then you lock it and then you lock these and then they kind of emit light from inside. So these two are really cute. You can hang these or just put them on your tables or somewhere. So the next thing I got was these candle stands. I would leave the link of everything down below in the, just in the description box. And then these are candle stands. I got it in three sizes. This is... I got one big one and then a medium one and then one small one so i'm thinking to put this into my living room on the table <laughs> okay then is the fun part and my most favorite item so i got these lanterns now they are one of my favorites look at how pretty they are so you open these from here and then you can keep either keep in your pillar candle the fat ones or your fairy lights i'm going to be putting it in the fairy lights so and then this is the big one so this i'm thinking to place in my mom's room and this into the living room fairy lights you just need to plug it in buy some fairy lights too so these are the free ones but i really 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 love these two pieces and how beautiful they look as a child i've always lived in dubai and all of you watching you know dubai is a center of attraction and during ramadan they decorate the city so beautifully every mall every nook and corner when i see other small lanterns hanging and these and when i found these i was so happy and then i got a box of obviously some fairy lights this is a wooden tray so this is a very sturdy and you know good quality tray so i'm thinking to put this and maybe this and the candle here and put this into the living room this is the the sealed nectar biography of the noble prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam so this Ramadan, I really wanted to work on my knowledge about the prophets and I thought what better way to start with Prophet Muhammad I was searching for the best books with no changes and I found this and this is the first prize winner book. And you get it on Amazon. I got this for around 400 or 300 rupees and you can get this is really good. I've also seen people from the foreign use it so it's I'm thinking it's legit and I hope I know Amazon, Amazon is going really ham with the packaging but legit gave me these in this big box let me show you 
in this big box this big box they gave me these two lanterns so, uh -huh. now let's get on to decorating <laughs> So I went straight to bed. So it's the next day. The iftar is done. Alhamdulillah. I have taken a shower and now we are going to decorate our living room. So if I would use this here it looks really big so I might be putting one of these candle stands along with one of these and the tray and I also have my tasbih which is not for decoration you should be reading it like you should be doing a dhikr on it I also have this candle that I bought and Ramadan Kareem and it smells really nice So I'm going to put one of these fairy lights into the lantern and then we can just light them up. So first I'm going to add the batteries into it. 